another sort of uh, after refurb video, Orange Basil, um, which has oh, the coals about to fall down, which is cleaned up all right. It's a wee bit dusty actually. Let me get a cloth quickly and just do this. There you go. Now he's not as dusty. It's cleaned up all right. Um, a bit scuffed there. All in all, it's not bad. These tools are borrowed off that, I think, um, but they're the right ones it would have had. It would have had the little cheapy brush and the crevice tool. If you look back there, now, a wee note here, 2005, week 28, you'll see this has gone yellow, and I believe that's because it's been used in an outdoor environment. I think from what the guy said, it was some kind of car valet in place. If you look at the wheels, the wheels are pretty rough, um, and the base is also a bit faded. Don't know if it shows up on camera really. So I think it's, from what he said, it's been used in a car sort of garage or valet in place, which is why the wheels are rough as toes. The base is a bit faded and that's gone yellow. However, you can't be picky when it comes to an orange basil, can you? Um, but the tub's in good condition. I think there's just a few faded patches on it. The cable has been replaced. The cable was at fault with it. Um, that's a wee bit distorted. I don't think I put it in right. Oops. Um, this cable and the cord hook just come off a scrappy George I've got over there and I'm going to put a more exciting cable on that George and just use it for the car. Um, so yeah, it does have a Volex. It did have the sort of other plug they used in the 2005 but I find... Ah, Henry Heron's got one, I'll demonstrate. It had this plug. Oh, that is a fuse cover. Oh, I hope I've not binned that flex. I could use the fuse cover off that one. I'll go and have a look actually. Yeah, those plugs are all... Cables are always breaking in my experience, um, but yeah, I've sort of lost my train of thought, I'm speaking a bit quickly, if you look inside, filter's been through the machine, the dust that was coming off of this, like I hoovered it with the NRV200 and thought, right, that's fine, and I was shaking it, I thought, oh, there's more dust coming out of it, so I shook it for a bit, and I thought, that must be it, now, nope, still dust coming off of it, I was hitting it off stuff, dust, but it came up clean. And have a paper bag in here. Now, have you used this once? And it is quite nice to use. Um, you know, they kind of fall in quite nicely, these ones without a cord wheel, but they'll be a bit lighter. Um, another curious thing is it has a UDS motor in it. Now, I and other collectors were a bit surprised by that because we would have thought it would have had one of those whiny, um, oh, if only I hadn't buried that grey, I've got a grey pneumatic like this. Yeah, you've seen it, and since you've seen it last, it's got one of the whiny motors in it now. We could have compared how they sound, but yeah, usually, you know the white plastic whiny motors, not the ones you use now, but the 1200 watts that we're using at one point, we would have thought it would have had one of them in it, but no, it's got a UDS in it, um, which I prefer. Perhaps they were just using up old stock or whatever. It's got really good suction on it being UDS, of course. I can't really be bothered getting up, but you know, you can see that. Something's whistling. I think this is Being a UDS, it's not too loud either. Um, by the way, the motor, absolutely mint. The later UDS motors I've had no problem with. Good motor, good motor, good motor, good motor, one in there, yeah, so on and so forth. So yeah, even though it's probably seen some use, it was in really good nick, the motor. So yeah, that's Orange Basil. Um, I got another, oh, you've seen it, you've seen the red pneumatic. You've seen the first look that I got off this guy. Um, so yeah, what am I filming next? I don't know, actually. Um, I don't know. Hmm. I fixed Henry Hound. If you want to see another video on him, comment. But I think I've videoed him to death a bit. I think it's like three videos on him. So yeah, thanks for watching.